Hey, YouTube Texas Blades here. So we got a new knife review to do, uh, courtesy of the fat man, Chad Spearman. If you haven't seen his uh, channel, go check it out. Um, I'll, I'll leave a link below somewhere to where you can get to his channel. Uh, I won his contest, and this is one of the blades that was in the contest. Believe it or not, I was in the market for a new uh, tactical fixed blade style knife. I was looking at quite a few different ones, and actually I wanted the SOG uh, seal team knife and now I don't have to go buy anything because I'm going to use this one. Uh, this knife does come with a sheath. The sheath stuck on my pack. It's a Kydex sheath. Just regular Kydex sheath. Uh, nothing real fancy but good enough that it works and I've got it uh, attached to my pack. That's why you don't see the sheath here. A uh, little bit of technicals on the blade itself. A couple of specs. It is 440 stainless steel. Uh, black linen micarta handles uh, with double rivets. <clears throat> it is full tang, of course. Um, has a four and five eighths inch drop point blade on it. The blade is one and three sixteen inch wide, and it is three sixteen inch thick. Overall, this knife is nine and seven eighths, so right under ten inches. And again, it does come with a molded uh, Kydex sheath. And the full name on the knife is Boker Magnum Highlander Ranger Tactical Knife. Model number BKMB522. Uh, just in case you wanted to go look it up or something. A little bit on the knife. I really do like the knife. I love the handle. Um, I wish a couple of things would have been done different like that. I wish they would have ran the jimping all the way across the handles. Uh, as well as the back of the blade here. Or the back of the handle rather. I wish they'd have ran it across the handle scales as well. Uh, just give it a little bit more grip on back of it because these handles they're my card so they are going to be a little bit slick uh, I'm definitely not wrapping them because I love the handles. I love the way they look That's just a neat looking design if you ask me uh, The handles feel great in your hand. I do have a beefy hand and it's a little bit small for me the handle uh, So it's probably perfect for most people. You know what I mean? I would say that it's a perfect uh knife handle you know for me it a it, little bit more meat right here would be nice just because my, my hand my hands are so big you know the bigger your hand the more handle you need the more uh, real estate you need down there I can say that it's wide enough or long enough rather it's just not wide enough uh, it's got a lanyard hole on the bottom of it here you can put some cordage on it and you know make a little safety lanyard for it haven't got to play with it much so this is more or less just first impressions and first impressions are uh, killer for me I'm not sure what the price on the knife is uh, I'm gonna say somewhere in the probably 40 35 40 dollar range somewhere cool ass knife I really like it thank you fat man uh, I'm gonna put some good use in with this and we'll be doing some videos on it so be looking out for those that's gonna be it for this one thanks for watching YouTube